Hey guys, what's going on? Just want to do a first impression video on this thing. I just picked it up from my FFL. And, uh, I don't know, let's go over it real fast. <clears throat> There's one thing I did notice that I don't really like already. But, the looks, it looks cool. I'm not going to bore you with anything, uh, what it can't, what it comes with or anything like that. I mean, uh, we'll do a separate video on that. But, you know, it looks great. I wanted it. Just to, I wanted the 365 to work, but I had no real faith in it. But I'm just gonna try this one out. People are saying that there's no more striker drag, so I'm gonna try it. Uh, I really like the optics ready plate on it. I mean, it looks great. It's got the flat trigger. I mean, great. Uh, ergonomics, it feels pretty good in the hand. It is digging into my knuckle over here a little bit. But, I mean, holding it, it feels good. It feels better than a 43X. Uh, so I'll give it that. The sights are, are really great. You know, it comes with really, really bright front green sight. I'm used to the orange, but the, the green the green looks really good. You know, it's got night sights in the back, and the, it's got the tritium in the front. So it came well-oiled. Uh, it was in a bag. Comes with two 12 mags, you know, and it's kind of got a little dug out here, so if you needed to pull it out. So, pretty cool, and uh, the mag wells flared. The one thing, when I was playing with this at uh, my FFL, wanted to test out the trigger. So, everyone says it's got a really great trigger, and uh, I mean, yeah, yeah. Trigger, it's nothing special. I mean, some take up and a wall, some grit, and then it breaks. So, I'm like, all right. It's, it's not bad. I mean, the front side doesn't move, so obviously I'll probably be accurate with it. But would I try to, f uh, to feel the reset on it? That's when I was like, what the hell? So, <laughs> how hard is that to rack? I mean, fucking, it's hard. It's hard as hell to rack if you're holding this trigger back, you know? And as soon as you pull the trigger, it's supposed to, you know, rounds going, rounds going out, brass coming out. So it should not be that hard, you know? And it's it's not like it's, you know, once every few times, it's, it's every damn time, all right? What do I got here? It's close, here. Yeah. It's a 320. So, not the greatest trigger either, but Nice and smooth, you know. No problem there. Oh, what else? We got here? You know. Shadow two, obviously amazing. You know, no problems. Anything, shit. Oh, Freaking World War Two P thirty eight. Perfect, you know. But I don't know what's going on with this thing. Seriously, you know. I, you know. Should not be like that. I mean, and even if Sig comes out and says that it should, you know, that's how it is, that's ridiculous. Okay. Um, I'm going to try to go to the range tomorrow. And I mean, I don't even know if I want to put rounds down right and just waste rounds on this thing and, or just sell it as is right now. I mean, it's brand new still. Uh, I don't know. 
I guess we'll see. I mean, at this point, it doesn't really matter. But uh, that's the one thing that has me worried. Uh, anyone else that has this thing, if you want to test that out, maybe uh, tell me if yours doesn't do that or if yours does do it and you got some you know, range time with it, uh, let me know. As of right now, who knows? I mean, uh, I don't see anything wrong with the, you know, inside the firearm. But, uh, who knows? Looks pretty good inside. And, uh, There is one thing also too I forgot. So if it's broken down and, and you accidentally hit this the trigger, or if you wanted to try it a little bit, it's gonna raise this bar up and you're not gonna be able to put your slide back on. So push that slide or that uh I don't know if that's a safety or yeah, it looks like the uh it's the disengagement for the the striker safety, the firing pin safety. So just make sure that that's down. Here. That right there. That stays up. At least on this one, it stays up. So I'll keep it back down. Now you can put your slide on. So. Yep. But uh, anyone's got any issues already with it? Let me know. See you.